So this is my part two for Uranus and Taurus and Cancer, and I just wanted to mention Cancer. This is a tremendously lucky upcoming seven years for you. Um, this is, in the next seven years, you can really have it all in with this Uranus and Taurus shift. You have to just sort of put on a persona that you're not going to be pushed around. Like Wayne Dyer used to say, people are pushing you around because you're sending them signals push me around more, I'll take that. You can't do that anymore, Cancer, because you're about to have it all. You are about to have your ultimate wish. Um, you are about to graduate magnum cum laude of the classes when it comes to energy and when it comes to getting it all, when it, um, in love and money, in, in all of those things. But you just have to believe that you deserve it and you have to stop doubting your strength. You have to kind of put some steel in your backbone and, you know, say to yourself, sitting here and bemoaning my station or circumstance or how others make me feel is not getting anything done. You have to show them that you're not going to let them push you around anymore. Essentially, everyone enters our life and teaches us something. And Cancer, you are, you know, you are the mother of the signs. You really like to take care of people, but taking care of certain people uh, sometimes holds you back. Uh, for some of you, this does not have to do with a romantic relationship. This has to do with people that you are maybe letting into your life work-wise, and they are kind of um, dragging you all over the place and maybe uh, telling you what you want to hear, but they are... Uh, not really allowing you to get a leg up with getting anything done so um, remember that but that is something to consider all right thank you so much ciao for now bye bye